The National Association of Nigerian Students has threatened to mobilize protests to disrupt academic activities on campuses across the Southwest if student union governments are not reinstated in certain institutions in the region within the next two weeks. Details in this report. I will bring you that story in our subsequent Bulletins. In a significant commitment to improving health care, the Chief Medical Director of Union Oshun Teaching Hospital, Dr. Babatunde Afolabi, has pledged to enhance patients' experience, safety and satisfaction. Dr. Afolabi shared his visionary transformation agenda with journalists outlining key strategies designed to elevate the institution's standards of excellence. The CMB emphasized the urgent need for research and innovation which will promote collaborations and drive cutting-edge research to improve operational efficiency. Dr. Babato Diafolabi is the first substantive chief medical director of the hospital since the dissolution of joint ownership between Oyo and Oshun State of the former Laduki Akintola University of Technology and its teaching hospital in Oshubu. I put forward what I call a five-pillar agenda I talk transformational agenda in making Union Ocean Teaching Hospital a friendly hospital and having a vision to produce high quality and versatile medical doctors, a specialist and other healthcare professionals that can compete favorably with others in the world and to provide high quality healthcare services provide leadership in medical knowledge, practice through clinical researches, enhance capacity and skills of medical practitioners in the public service. The Benin State Government has charged parents and caregivers to prioritize vaccinating children as the only way to protect future generations from the risk of polio. The Commissioner for Health and Human Services, Yamar Otse, will give this chat to commemorate the 2024 World Polio Day in Makodi, Mayawa, Kwato, has the details. The journey towards a polio-free Benue state in honor of the 2024 World Polio Day kicked off in Makadi, the state administrative capital. Health sector, stakeholders and international partners led a symbolic walk through the streets of Makadi, ending at the state secretariat. The state commissioner for health expresses gratitude to all partners for their critical support in the fight against polio. He calls on parents and guardians to bring their children to the nearest health facility for routine humanization, advancing Benway's goal of eradicating polio. I encourage all families to visit their nearest health facility for routine immunizations and to support health initiatives within their communities. This year's theme, Vaccine Works for All, captures the heart of our mission to protect every child and every community through the power of vaccines. The Health Commissioner also urged all stakeholders to stay vigilant and proactive, emphasizing the importance of dispelling myths surrounding vaccines and strengthening the public confidence in the ministry's immunization program. Dispelling myths and misconceptions about vaccines and reinforcing confidence in our immunization programs is essential for us to reach our goal of a polio-free brainwave. The lessons and advancements from our polio campaigns serve as a model for improving healthcare delivery across the state. This year's theme, It's Humanly Possible, highlights the potential to save Life through immunization and underscores the impact of community action against polio. Mayowa Okwanso, CVC News, Makadi.